Hey, it's Marcia. Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be all about me doing a review on my Louis Vuitton pochette accessoire bag right here. Uh, this is her in all of her glory. I love this bag so much. I have it in the monogram print or monogram canvas, I should say. And this is like my everyday bag right here. This is like my going out bag, date night, girls night running errands um, and you'll see why and I'm so happy that I purchased this bag like a while back mainly because like price increases right price increases right um, so yeah if you are interested in purchasing this bag I would just say go ahead and purchase it because you are gonna get your money's worth you're gonna love it you're gonna use it on a daily basis and it's just it's affordable, if you know what I mean, like in terms of like Louis Vuitton handbags and things like that. Although this is, I guess, technically like a SLG, maybe, I think, but um, I use it as a handbag, so there's that. I'm thinking like Louis Vuitton is increasing their prices on this bag as well because they realize like people actually use it as a bag and it's becoming so much more popular. It may look petite, but it actually holds a lot of items. And it's actually like a pretty good size. I'm like five, 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 six for reference. Um, and this hits like it just it doesn't look too small. You know what I mean? You know when you like purchase a bag that's a mini bag, but you're not exactly like the shortest person in the world, so it just looks a bit awkward. I don't know for me at least. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and jump to some close-ups uh, for those who want to see like you know up close and personal. Everything that I do have from Louis Vuitton, I don't have a lot. I don't have a lot. But everything that I do have is in the monogram canvas, which is like my all-time favorite print. I don't know. I've thought about the Aben, but um, I just... I love the monogram. I feel like it looks classic. It's neutral. It goes with everything. I love the patina on the pochette, the pochetta. So yeah, I did purchase this bag like the end of 2017, 2018. I had my eye on it for like maybe two years, and then I was or like a year and a half, um, and then I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna purchase this bag because like you know I've taken care of all my responsibilities, you know and whatnot <laughs> but um yeah the way i kind of operate with my purchases is like if i really really want something i'm gonna buy it so maybe at the beginning i was kind of debating and trying to do my research but then i was like mm, i don't know if i really want this bag or if this bag like goes well with my lifestyle but then as time went by i was like i really do want this bag this bag fits my lifestyle perfectly and it will be like a transitional piece like, i think i had a the game you know what i mean <laughs> I'm one of those people that thinks a lot. So yeah, the type of things that I think about when I'm purchasing a bag is like, am I gonna use this every day? What exactly am I gonna use this for? Is this gonna be like my date night, girls night, going out, running errands, going to work type of bag? Like how much use out of this bag am I really gonna get? So after my brain kind of like wraps its mind around all that, <laughs> And I think around that time, I realized that Louis Vuitton does do their like price increases, which I was like, what? But yeah, so crossbody, a clutch, and then as like a catch-all bag is how I use this um, bag mainly. So yeah. Oh, and then I almost forgot. And then in terms of the seasons, I wear this in every season. I know there's like a piece of pochetta here, which is like untreated when you do purchase it. So this will patina, meaning like get darker over time with more use, basically as it you know, lives its life with oxygen and sun and all that stuff, it will get darker. But um, yeah, so I wear this, like I live in Canada, for those who didn't know, I live in Canada. I live in Toronto, sort of, but yeah, I live in the GTA is what I should say. And um, so yeah, I wear this during like winter season. Um, Spring, summer, 
fall like all season all year round there's just a little tap of the shed in here so it's not a big deal if snow or rain gets on it i have no watermarks on this little piece anyway um, but yeah i've never had any issues with it even my wristlet i have no watermarks on that and in terms of the winter seasons like if i'm going out for like dinner brunch or like a family get together or something like that i may wear this um but um it's not like an everyday bag in the winter seasons just because i'm mostly going to work during the winter so it's like i just have my work bag and that's all i really need and then if anything i'll have this inside of my work bag if that makes sense so that's pretty much when i wear this bag basically all seasons um we have all seasons some seasons last a little longer than others here in canada but um yeah so let's talk about like the versatility of this bag in terms of like going with your outfits and matching with your outfits and things like that. I think it's my hair. So yeah, the one reason why, well not the one reason, but one of the major reasons why I actually love the monogram canvas print is because it's in neutral colors. Like it's a beautiful dark brown. Who doesn't like dark brown? You know, who doesn't like brown? Think about it. Um, and then it has like the caramel in the monogram print. Um, and then it has the gold hardware, which, and then it has gold hardware. I don't know why I just blurred that word, or those two words. Anyways, um, then it has the gold hardware here. And I think it just, it's a perfect contrast with the brown and the gold, you know what I mean? And then the bachetta, which when it patinas to this beautiful almond type of color, it is just delectable I love it um yeah that's another reason why I love this bag because the print is neutral so if you're one of those people that wears a lot of like black um, white gray brown like the neutral colors you know what I mean um, this will go with your outfit on a daily basis which it does for me because my wardrobe is pretty you know consistent it consists of um, black um, white beige like um that oatmeal kind of color um you know i might do some like rose pink type of colors like neutrals essentially my wardrobe is very neutral and white um that's pretty much my wardrobe and you know what another thing is too i know some people will be like i prefer the ebon because like it's less flashy i guess so to speak um because not everybody will know that print as louis vuitton but I don't know. I don't think this is like too flashy. And that could be simply because the bag is smaller and there's not a whole bunch of like hardware on the bag. You know what I mean? So it's kind of understated. But I feel like even though everybody will know this is Louis Vuitton, it's not like too in your face. You know what I mean? Um, so yeah. And even if it is, it's Louis Vuitton either way. So like people will know. Okay. So, so the next, I don't know why I'm getting so excited. So I'm even like, why am I all the way in here? Let me, let me pull it back. But um, what I was gonna say is like, um, so in terms of sizing, so there's like this, which I would consider to be like the standard size, if you will. And then there's like the mini pochette, which is like maybe like this big, right? And for me, I saw both of them when I purchased this. And I like, I'm not gonna lie, I think the mini pochette in the monogram print monogram canvas is like super cute it, it is really cute. it's cute and it comes with like a gold chain that hangs like right in front and I did love it I still do love it the only thing that I was thinking about is that like is this like does this peak does this peak <laughs> does this piece work well with like my lifestyle and what my purpose of using it for you know what I mean does the piece match my lifestyle? Let's just sum it up like that. <laughs> so I just wanna talk about some of the details that I fell in love with. So one being that the print is a monogram canvas, the colors are neutral, the gold hardware, which I love, gold pote. You have the two gold um, loops on each side, so you can attach your um, shoulder strap as well as like a crossbody strap if you have one. This says Louis Vuitton Paris made in France. This is another thing, all of my pieces are made in France. I am not here for made in USA. Nothing against United States of America or anything like that, but if I'm buying a luxury piece that is originally from France, I want it to be made there. Like, I don't understand. Like, 
I don't care if US is like right across the border from me. I want it to come from France. That's just period. So some of the other details that I want to talk about is like the stitching. It's like a yellow stitching, which makes it pop even more. It goes so well with like the neutral canvas colors, the gold hardware, the patina on the full tag here on the pachetta. Also the round edges. So like the corners are round. They're not like pointy and straight. And I love the way that it looks because of it being round. Um, I'll come closer so you guys can see, but it is round. And then also the width of the bag as well is, um, you know, is a nice comfortable size enough for you to really pack in what you need in this bag. And that's another thing. So um, for those who are thinking of buying this pre-loved, um, try to make sure that you're buying the newer version because this one is, I guess, technically the newer version of the Louis Vuitton pochette accessoire um, because the older version is actually smaller. So it's not as wide, meaning that it doesn't fit as much things. And I guess it's a bit shorter in length. Also, the strap that comes with the bag is shorter. So it's gonna be all up under your armpits. So <laughs> those are just some things to think about if you are gonna buy pre-love. Um, two other things I wanna know, probably three, <laughs> is that the gold was a really good choice. If this was in silver, I feel like this would not look as good as it does. Um, so definitely going with the gold was a perfect choice for this bag design. Also, I would say that mine, I've had this for three years now, and the gold on the hardware is still pretty much there, which is like amazing. I'm so here for that. Um, another thing that I want to know is that this bag is structured. So I love a structured bag. And this bag right here is structure with a bit of flexibility. So it's not super structured where it's like it won't move, you know what I mean? But it's structured enough where like the bottom lays flat. Um, but the inside of this bag is, a, I'm just gonna show you guys the best that I can. So, let me step back a bit, there we go. So the inside of this bag is a brown lining. And it has like a little pocket back here. Let me see if I can show you guys. See back here, I have some Vaseline and stuff. There is like one little pocket, and I don't believe the old version has a pocket. So there's that, and then the inside is just a beautiful like brown, like beautiful, gorgeous. Um, these are just, I'm gonna do like a what's in my bag, because I kind of threw everything in here. I was like, oh my God, I gotta run errands. Let me just throw my stuff in here. The sun's out type of thing, you know what I mean? So yeah. So um, this is the strap that it comes with. Here's the strap. As you can see, it's not super patina because I don't wear it a whole lot, but there's like a gold um, clasp and it has the LV. Let's see if you guys can see this. Right there. And the LV there. And then the other side, you kind of loop it through. Like this. And that's how you attach it to the bag. All right, so my camera just died, so I'm not really sure but where I left off. But this is the box uh, that my pochette accessoire com com <laughs> came in. Um, so this is the packaging right here. It's like a very nice burnt orange. It's really nice. And then it just obviously says Louis Vuitton, and it has a magnetic closure. And then this is the dust bag that it comes with. So, um, so just for show and tell purposes. Like this is the bag, there's the dust bag. And that just prevents it from getting all dusty and you know. If you haven't already, please make sure that you guys hit that subscribe button. Subscribe if you haven't already. Push that bell notification so that you stay up to date on all of my videos. And also give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoy watching what's in my bag related videos. Be sure to drop a comment down below. Let me know, do you have the Louis Vuitton pochette accessoire? Are you thinking about purchasing this bag? If you haven't, why haven't you? Like, are you waiting for another price increase? Leave a comment down below, let me know. Or even if you're just like stocking this bag and like going through every review on this bag to make your like informed decision on purchasing this bag, leave a comment down below. I just want to thank you guys so much for showing my channel so much love. Until next time, see you guys in my next video. Bye.